We have reached the fourth round of elimination bracket play. The winner of this match will advance in the elimination bracket. This contest features Tuttle High School and Jackson Preparatory School. Let's meet the teams. Edward Wilson, sophomore. Ty Yusey, senior. Alex Robertson, senior. Selby Ireland, senior. Jake Matthews, sophomore. Camp Carter, senior. Freddie Gill, senior. Justin Yee, senior. Wyatt Carter, senior. Richie Yang, junior. So we'll begin the match with a five point toss up question. Which word beginning and ending with A designates both foolish or unintelligible talk and a magical charm to ward off disaster and is also used by magician to in- Tuttle High, what? Abracadabra. Yes. For 10 points, which state was known as the mother of bandits in the 19th century since it was the home of Jesse James, the James Gang, and other outlaws? Tuttle High, what? Texas. No. Jackson Prep, Pat. Arizona? No. The answer is Missouri. For 10 points, which blind Greek poet was called the Swan of Meander, possibly because he... Jackson Prep, Alex. Homer. Yes. For five points, which branch of chemistry is sometimes called the chemistry of hydrocarbons and their derivatives? Jackson Prep, Pat. Organic chemistry. Yes. For 20 points, which word beginning with the letter I designates the forceful entry of magma or molten rock into fissures between strata. Jackson Prep, Alex. Igniation. No. Tuttle High, what? Intrusion. Yes. For 20 points, identify the mountains in northwestern Africa whose highest point is Jebel Tipkal. Jackson Prep, Pat. The Atlas Mountains? Yes. For 10 points, we have a math question. What is the product when the quantity 2 minus the square root of 3 is multiplied by its conjugate? Jackson Prep, Selby. 1. Yes. For 10 points, name the deadly disease known at one time as consumption and... Jackson Prep, Ty. Tuberculosis? Yes. For 15 points, Name the Irish-born novelist and playwright who won the 1969 Nobel Prize in Literature. He wrote What, Endgame, and Waiting for Godot. Tell high, read. Samuel Beckett. Yes. For 10 points, it's a math question. If five inches on a map represent 100 miles, how many inches on the map represent 160 miles? Tell high, what? Eight. Yes. For 10 points, which Italian city is known for its Doge's Palace near St. Mark's? Jackson Prep, Pat. Venice. Yes. For 10 points, name the pressure created by the diffusion of water through a selectively permeable... Jackson Prep, Sully. Osmosis. No. Membrane. Filtration. No. It's osmotic pressure. For 10 points, who was the church's first great missionary who preached to the Gentiles while a Roman prisoner? Jackson Prep, Alex. Paul. Yes. For 10 points, give the term used to describe an instrument such as a saxophone pitched higher than a bass and lower. Pedal high, what? Alto. No. Lower than a tenor. Jackson Prep, Alex. Baritone. Yes. For 10 points, although India's first prime minister from 1947 to 1964 advocated a foreign policy of neutrality and non-alignment, he failed to achieve peaceful coexistence with communist China. Name this leader whose first name was Jawaharlal. Jackson Prep, Pat. Nehru. Yes. For 10 points, identify the degenerative disease of the liver usually caused by chronic alcoholism. Pedal high, what? Cirrhosis. Yes. It's a math question for 10 points. What is the simplified form of the square root of 54? Pedal high, what? Uh, 2 square root of 13. No. 
Second print, Sylvia. Three radical six. Yes. For 20 points, identify the Chilean dictator from 1973 to nine. Second print, time. Pinochet. Yes. For 20 points, which group with the initials OT ruled Western Armenia from 1514 until their defeat in World War I? Second print, time. Ottoman Turks. Yes. For 10 points, what family of musical instruments contains the oboe? Section prep, Alex. Woodwind. Yes. For 15 points, identify the two African countries whose names end in the letters Y, nope. A. Nope. And that's the end of round one. We'll be back in a moment with a preliminary score. After round one, Pedal High has 60 points and Jackson Prep has 155 points. Now we're heading into round two, a toss up with bonus questions round. We're gonna start round two with a math question for 10 points. Nine halves of four is equal to two ninths of what number? Second prep, Sylvie. One fourth. No. Pedal high, why? 81. Yes. Here are your bonus questions, pedal. Name either of the current U.S. Senators from the state. For five points, South Carolina. I'm thinking Chris Christie, but that's all I got. Chris Christie is all I got for you. Chris Christie is all I got for you. Chris Christie. Chris Christie? No. no. Jackson Prep? Yes. Yes. Okay. And we're going to go back to a toss-up for 10 points. The skin condition, Tanae of Pettis, makes a person itchy. What is its common name? Pedal high, Brady. Rash. No. Second prep, tax. Skin cancer. It's athlete's foot. For 10 points. Which word completes the following line from Shakespeare's King Richard III? Now is the blank of our discontent. Pedal high, why? Start. No. Section prep, Sylvie. End. The answer is winter. You'll need a pencil for this next toss-up worth 10 points. If the temperature is 22 degrees Celsius, what is the temperature expressed as Kelvin? Second prep time. 295 degrees Kelvin. Yes. Yes. And here are your bonus questions. Identify each of the following concerning sleep. For five points, what Washington Irving character fell asleep for 20 years? Rip Van Winkle. Yes. For 10 points, what Austrian neurologist studied dreams and described sleep as the royal road to the unconscious? Freud. Yes. For 15 points, in which ballet by Tchaikovsky did Margot Fontaine captivate New York in 1949 in the role of Princess Aurora? I can smell crack. Nutcracker. No. Petal. Need an answer. Say no answer. No no answer. Okay, no answer. The answer is Sleeping Beauty. And so we move back to a toss up for 15 points. Which of Newton's laws explains the fact that when a fish moves by swishing its tail, exerting force in water, the water exerts an equal and opposite? Pedal high, Justin. The third law? Yes. And here are your bonus questions. Identify each of the following concerning diseases. For five points, Bone disease that occurs mostly in children under three years of age and results in conditions called bow legs, knock knees, and rosary ribs. It's rickets. Rickets. Yes. For 10 points, common name for rubiola. Common name for rubiola. It does sound like rabies. I go with rabies. Rabies. No. Jackson Prep. 
Scarlet fever, just like measles. Scarlet yeah. fever? Yeah. It's the measles. And we're back to a toss up for five points. Name the 19th century American inventor who was assisted by a man named Watson. Dr. Krupp, Alec. Crick. Why? Bell. Yes. Okay. Here are your bonus questions. One at a time, name any four of the 12 major deities in Greek mythology as listed by the World History of Encyclopedia. For five points, name one. Zeus. Okay, Zeus. For 10 points, name another. Hera. Hera. Okay, Poseidon. for 15 points, name another. Poseidon. Yes, and for 20 points, name another. Ares, Hades, Hades, Hades. Hades. That is, uh, for 20 points. Ares. Yes. Ares, yes. Okay. All right, that concludes the end of round two. We'll be back with a preliminary score in a moment. So we're back after round two. We have a preliminary score. Pedal High, 125. Jackson Prep, 205. Now we're headed into round three, another toss-up with bonus questions round. For 10 points, it's a math question. If three astronauts are chosen at random from the seven who have met the standards for the next mission, what is the probability that the threesome of Andy, Brittany, and Chris will be chosen? Pedal high, what? One, one hundred twentieth. No. <coughs> Dr. Prep, uh, Selvig. Six out of three hundred and uh, forty-three. No. It's one out of thirty-five. So we're back to a toss-up for five points. Name the English fictional detective who was assisted by a man named Watson. <coughs> Sherlock. Yes. Okay, and well, we go to your bonus question. Uh, yeah, thank you. All right. Identify each of the following concerning medicine in the search for you. For five points, Spanish explorer who sought the fountain of youth. Leon. Yes. Yes. And we move back to a toss-up for 20 points. Name both the site and the state where the U.S. 7th Cavalry killed over 200 men, women, and children of Chief Bigfoot's Band of Sioux on December 29, 1890, in the last major clash between federal troops and American Indians in the U.S. Dr. Brett Pat. Um, Bigfoot, Montana. Little Little Creek, South Dakota. No. It's Wounded Knee, South Dakota. For 10 points, a toss-up. Identify the Italian sculptor whom Rodin said freed him from an academic approach and inspired his first major work, The Age of Bronze. This Italian is known for his statues of the biblical Moses and David. Dr. Prep, time. Um, Donatello? No. Michelangelo? Yes. And here are your bonus questions. Answer each of the following concerning literature. For five points, in which work by George Orwell do the animals on Manor Farm revolt against Mr. Jones? Animal Farm. Yes. For ten points, which work by Arthur Miller features Willie Loman, a traveling salesman? The Death of the Salesman? Yep. For 15 points, city in which Anne Frank wrote her diary.
Fremberg. <laughs> yes. Yes. All right, and we go back to a toss-up for five points. Which peak is the highest in Africa? Kilimanjaro. Yes. And here are your bonus questions. Identify each of the following concerning Spanish. For five points, Tierra del Fuego is the Spanish collective name ascribed by Ferdinand Magellan to a group of islands off the southern tip of South America. What is the English translation of Tierra del Fuego? Um, land of fire. Yes. For 10 points, diacritical mark the Spanish put on their ends. Intonation? No. Yes. Yes. And we go back to a toss up for 15 points. In which country is Mount Kilimanjaro? Uh, Tanzania? Yes. yes. And here are your bonus questions. Identify each of the following concerning chemistry. For five points, give the number of moles of gas and 44.8 liters of that gas at STP. Two. 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 Yes. For 10 points, of the ions, sodium, calcium, magnesium, and lithium, the two which determine the hardness of water. Calcium and magnesium. Yes. For 15 points, give the hybridization for carbon in methane. It's uh, SP3. SP3? Yes. And for 20 points, give the term used to designate the passage of a gas through a tiny orifice into an evacuated chamber. Effusion. Effusion? Yes. All right. And that concludes the end of round three. We'll be back in a moment with a preliminary score. At the end of round three, the score is pedal high, 165, Jackson Prep, 300. We now move into round four, which is a toss-up only round. The first toss-up question is a math question for 10 points. V varies directly as the square of S. If S equals two, and V equals 12, find the value of V when S equals 4. Jackson Prep, J. 24? No. Pedal high, Y. 48. Yes. For five points, which word designates both a large pocket knife and an unexpected and accidental 90 degree turn of a trailer on a hitch? High, rate. Jack nine. Yes. For 10 points, as seen from the planet Earth, the planet Mercury passed over the disk of the sun on November 5th, 1993. What word beginning with T designates such a passage of a smaller celestial body across the disk of a larger one? Pedal high, Y. Traversal. No. Jackson Prep, Alex. Transversal? No. It's transit. A toss-up for five points. Which name identifies the Byzantine emperor from 717 to 741, the pope of the Roman Catholic Church from 795 to 816, and the fifth sign of the zodiac, also called the lion? Section prep time. Leo. Yes. For 20 points, ray-finned fish have four pairs of gills. What term beginning with the letter O designates the protective flap of tissue that covers each set of gills? Time. The answer is operculum. A toss up for 10 points. After escaping and settling in Massachusetts in 1838, Fugitive slave Frederick Augustus Washington Bailey adopted the surname Douglas, borrowed from the hero of Lady of the Lake, a fictional work by which Scottish author? Time. It was Sir Walter Scott. A toss-up for five points. 
Which character in Shakespeare's Julius Caesar, Act 3, Scene 2, Line 13, says, Romans, countrymen, and lovers, hear me for my cause, and be silent that... Dr. Prep, so... John, answer me. No. That you may hear. Why? Julius Caesar. No. It was Brutus. For 10 points, which president did William Jennings Bryan serve as Secretary of State from 1913 until 19? Section Prep, Ty. Woodrow Wilson. Yes. For 10 points, according to Benjamin Franklin's Poor Richard's Almanac, what two things make a man healthy, wealthy, and wise? Section Prep, Ty. Early to bed and early to rise. I mean, yes. Yeah. We have a math question for 10 points. Express the sum of x minus y and x squared minus y squared as the product of a binomial and a trinomial. X plus Y times X squared minus 2XY plus Y squared. No. Pedal high, Y. X minus Y times X minus Y times X plus Y. No. It's X minus Y times X plus Y plus 1. For 15 points, identify the mythological Greek god of the world and time. Pedal high, why? Kronos. Yes. For five points, name the Polish scientist who wrote the following in his 1543 book De Revol Revolutionibus Orbium Celestium. <laughs> Dr. Prep, time. Copernicus. Yes. I massacred that one. For 10 points, which word not only means to frustrate, but also designates a long, thin fencing sword and a... No. And that's the end of round four. We'll be back with a final score in just a moment. After four rounds of play, the final score is pedal high, 195, Jackson Prep, 330.